unbelievable. I mean, we have low humidity, very comfortable temperatures, and the next several days we're going to repeat this forecast. How about that? Going nice. into the weekend, it does become a little more humid for the second half of the weekend, but no big deal. Live look over Fenway Park where we have full sunshine over there, and it is going to be a top 10 weather day. Already is, according to some of our WBZ weather watchers and our weather bug network also uh, showing us at Fenway Park where the field is ready for the big game tonight as the stands fill up later this evening. It is going to be beautiful, 74 degrees and pleasant with a mostly clear sky, 710 for that first pitch tomorrow, 75, once again great, and we copy it over for Saturday too. Afternoon game, a few degrees hotter, but mix of sun and clouds, and it is very dry out there. Drought monitor just updated today, and we have more abnormally dry areas. Now southeastern Mass, a few more areas included in this shaded yellow spot that indicates abnormally dry. Moderate drought expanded just a little bit across portions of northern New England, and not a lot of rain in the seven-day forecast. Again, we're in this pattern that will continue this rainfall deficit, but good if you have any outdoor plans for the next several days. Satellite radar shows a few clouds moving in from the north, but a lot of those are starting to break apart. We'll see some more clouds pop up in the heat of the afternoon, and perhaps a few spring Sprinkles. Most of that should not make it to the ground. Mostly dry for us today. Again, 73 in Boston, near 80 in Norwood, 80 degrees in Lawrence, and the low to mid 70s across the Cape and the islands. And with that temperature of 73, it is very comfortable with the low dew point mixed in, 51. Wind from the east at 14 will keep temperatures along the coast slightly cooler than inland locations. Low 80s, Bedford to Taunton, and 76 degrees in Boston. Overnight tonight, down to 65, patchy fog developing, mostly clear. Or otherwise. Beach forecast for Friday looking good. However, keep in mind there is still a rip current risk as we get some high astronomical tides and also wave heights of about two to four feet for the next couple of days. But temperature on the beach there, 75. Water temp, yes, up to 72. High temperatures tomorrow, similar to what we have today. A few degrees warmer, upper 70s on the coast, low 80s inland. And for the weekend, Saturday 84, it does become a little more humid going into your Sunday as we will see a very weak cold front moving in on Saturday, bringing us a chance for an isolated shower or storm. But overall, the weekend looking good as we see this cold front move closer and closer to us for Saturday. A lot of the precipitation fizzles out as we get into Sunday. Wave height, just a quick check there, about two to three feet offshore. Not bad, but astronomical high tides means that we could see some minor splash over for the next several nights coinciding with those extra high tides. We call these king tides and we could be pushing minor flood stage even without any surge on top of it here in Boston. So there's a quick reference for you right there. Otherwise, enjoy the sunshine, dry weather, heat returns definitely next week with low 90s Monday and Tuesday.